everyone and welcome back to another video. This is gonna be like the March update even though it's a bit late because it's not March anymore or rather my March overview for the depth and width year thing because I didn't really pick one I decided to do both. Yeah so this is March because I didn't do March and we're already in April. I'm just gonna go through why it took me a bit to get to do this video. So anyways, yep. So first of all, in case you haven't watched my previous videos, I'll tell you in this one, I got a job starting, well, I got the job during March, but I started my job in April. So this has been my first week of my new job. Which is why it took me a little bit to, you know, get to doing videos again because I'm getting used to my new schedule, I'm getting used to the training and all that junk, and it's been pretty great so far. I'm really excited for all the changes that are going on in my life because, like, instead of sitting around the house doing nothing all day, finally I'm, like, out doing things that are exciting. Um, so that's really fun. My hair is extremely frizzy today, so that's great. Has nothing to do with work, it's just the weather sucks ass, and I look like a trash baby, so... You know, we're already starting off our video great, right? Um... Anyways, yeah, just been getting... the restructure on my life going on because now I've got a new thing going on, I've got to learn how to readjust everything, figure out how everything works with my job, and how I'm going to interact, you know, my regular life with my job life, and I'm still figuring all that out, so it's great. Because then I also have my YouTube life on top of that now that I have started, so it's just been me trying to shuffle everything into where it's going to be. That being said, let's get to the review of March. Um, so March, March was primarily width, like expansive this part of the year. And that's because, oh, hold on, let me grab it before I forgot, or before I forget. So March card for March was success. Was this truthful or no? Yes. <laughs> Very much yes. And um, I suspected at the beginning, I suspected at the beginning of the month that this would be because of a job. And I was correct. It was also successful in another form, which was I was going through something very like hard for me mentally and emotionally towards the beginning of the month, pretty much most of this month, and then towards the end of it, I finally sort of overcame my feelings on that. So I'm feeling a lot more confidence in myself than I did towards the beginning of the month. So successful in that fact that I wasn't expecting towards the first week of March, I had an interview for a place and I did, I decided against going to that one because I was more interested for my other upcoming interview. So I turned that interview down and then I went towards the one I had a good feeling for. I got hired for that one, which was the second week of March, I got hired. And I wasn't going to start my new job until April. So during those two week-ish period that I wasn't working, I was pretty much depressed. <laughs> Being, well, I feel like depressed is too strong of a word for it. I wasn't, I don't think I was really depressed. It was more I was um, feeling a bit, things were difficult. I just felt like I was sitting around waiting because I felt like maybe I should be trying to do something my last two weeks of not having work. And everyone I knew around me was kind of busy with their own stuff. So I was just kind of frustrated because I felt like I couldn't do anything. 
and I was just sitting around being bored and driving myself crazy. So as soon as I started work, that was a lifesaver for me in a majority of ways because Okay. <laughs> We're gonna ignore you outside. Um, where was I? Work. <laughs> Work was a good distraction for me in ways and it kept, it's been keeping me really excited, but I, there was also like the setback a little bit of like freaking out because I'm like, oh shit, now I actually have to do things and it's kind of scary because it's a new environment, new people, um, I've been, you know, as an introvert, I'm freaking terrified of talking to people, but taking on my extroverted energy, I'm just being like, you know, fuck it, we're putting myself out there. I've even dipped a little bit of my spiritual and pagan perspectives on certain things, and I kind of like, mm, should I have said that? And I'm like, well, too fucking late. I already said something that sounded a bit witchy. Great. So... You know, if people don't like me, at least I'll know right off the bat before, <laughs> like, I'll know who I like and who I don't like. I mean, I kind of just feel like, fuck it at this point. It's not like I have anything else to lose right now. So I'm like, mm, people don't like me, they don't like me. What? All I can do is just have fun in my work environment because I think I'm really going to enjoy the job, so... <sighs> There's just, it's just like <laughs> getting used to the new stuff. So what I need to look up real quick is the April card because I don't, I don't remember. I don't remember what it is. For the month of April, I got the moon. Um, this one's traditionally like either trusting your intuition, sort of using the moon, like the illumination in the dark, secrets. So I guess it'll be interesting to see how that correlates within real life. Um, I'm fairly interested to see how that plays into April and how things end up working. Anyways, not much else really going on um, for March. And my expectations for April are just sort of to focus on my job and, and to try and work out my schedule to see what best works for me for this month. So, yeah, not very long video, but I'll see you guys in the next one, I guess. Um, have a great day or great night or great whatever time. I'll see you next time. Bye.